you know, I have always been a spiritual, sensitive person, you know, always been. I was born this way. There's nothing I can do about it. I was born this way. So it was easy to fall into to the bullshit of the Roman Catholic Church. It was very easy, very easy. But it all ended in 2013 when I did my this baptism ritual, you know. It's a long story. But then I fell into the new age bullshit, which was easy too, being sensitive spiritual person. It was easy. It was very easy to fall into the new age wokeness bullshit, you know. But it all ended in 2020. It all ended in 2020. Because in 2020, you know, everybody was at home. Everybody was doing lives everywhere, including me, including me. So I did a bunch of lives. I did a bunch of lives. But one day, my friend invited me to a life. It's like, well, you got to come to this life. It's a spiritual life and school stuff right up your alley. I was like, okay, let's go. So I'm in the live over there. And then, you know, that day, I don't know, I felt inspired. I usually don't comment, but I felt inspired. So I comment. I was I said something about rock and roll. Then the lady goes, oh, you got to be careful with those rock and roll people. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah, whatever. That was it, man. That mm -hmm. ended right there. Ended in 2020 right there with my depression. I was like, this is it. It's going to end in this incarnation. So right after the live, right after the live, I went on the computer. You know what I did? I got a bass. Yeah. I was like, I got to slap the bass, man. I got to slap the bass, right? Right? Like, like I did in high school. So I got the base, and that's when the band start forming. Yeah, the whole thing start, the whole conspiracy start forming. Don Caste, conspiracy of one. Yeah, yeah, but that was that was the click. That was that was when the whole wokeness thing ended for me, right there in 2020 with my depression. 